Hey, Chef Billy Parisi here with Heinen's Grocery Stores, and I'm going to show you how to make an amazing roasted turkey breast with a delicious pomegranate balsamic glaze. We're going to start off with those turkey breasts. I've got some boned turkey breasts. If you want it bone in, that's totally fine too. This is a great alternative to cooking a big turkey. Also, sometimes they come in the net butcher's twine. This one does not have any, and you could cook it flattened just like you would a spatchcock chicken. But for me, I'm going to keep it folded over. I'm going to start off by seasoning it with salt and pepper. We're not going to stop there. We are going to completely unravel this boned turkey breast because we want to season all sides with salt and pepper. This is incredibly important, especially when you fold it back to ensure there's all that flavor in there. Now we are going in a large pot. I've got some olive oil over medium high heat. We're going to add in that turkey breast. And what we're going to do is cook it for three to four minutes per side. We just want to get a very nice golden brown. Don't worry, we're not going to try to cook it through completely on the cooktop. Now for a little bit of aromatics, I'm going to add on some fresh rosemary and thyme. And we are going in the oven on 375 degrees, going to take in between 50 and 55 minutes. Now for that pomegranate glaze, let's go ahead and add in some pomegranate seeds, some balsamic vinegar, and for a little bit of sweetness, some honey, you could use sugar or brown sugar here if you'd like. We're going to cook this over low heat. It's going to take about 10 to 15 minutes to thicken up. This is perfect consistency. It's just like a balsamic glaze. We're going to set it to the side, and when the turkey's done, take it out. We're going to plate it up and serve it with some of that pomegranate glaze. So delicious, so flavorful, and such a fantastic alternative to a whole roasted turkey, especially if you're only serving three to four people. I know you'll love this recipe.